Hello everyone, this is Dr. Meher Shah once again with another video. In this video, we are going to learn the difference between the fixed exchange rate and the flexible exchange rate system under the topic International Monetary System. So let us see what are the difference between the two terms. So the very first point under fixed exchange rate system is that fixed exchange refers to a rate which the government sets and maintains at the same level so this is already that we have went through earlier key fixed exchange rate is set by the government and it maintains at the same level on the other side flexible exchange rate is the rate that variates according to the market forces so it changes it does not fix it changes according to the market forces Next, the fixation rate system is determined by the government or the central bank, whereas the flexible flexible exchange rate system is determined by demand and supply forces. Fixed exchange rate system is periodically adjusted by the government. The government intervenes on regular basis, whereas under flexible exchange rate system, the exchange rate adjust automatically to the changes in the market forces so demand and supply fluctuates again okay, and automatically adjust the changes next under fixed exchange rate a fixed exchange rate has a devaluation and evaluation in a currency so the fixed exchange rate system creates devaluation and evaluation of a currency whereas under flexible exchange rate a flexible exchange rate can depreciate and appreciate the value of a currency so it can either appreciate or depreciate next government needs to keep huge amount of reserve to maintain the exchange rate at the desired level under fixed exchange rate system because we have already learned earlier key if the government want to intervene it will require to maintain a huge amount of foreign exchange reserve however under flexible exchange rate government does not intervene and it does not require any exchange rate reserves as well next the exchange rate are fixed and stable but may lead to market distortion in the long run so in the long run it is very difficult to have a fixed and a stable exchange rate however exchange rate fluctuates but remains stable around the equilibrium in the long run so in flexible exchange rate in the long run though it fluctuates and is volatile but in the long run it comes it becomes stable and in equilibrium next there is no hedging risk if the country is using fixed exchange rate However, hedging is used to reduce the currency risk in the flexible exchange rate. And last, a fixed exchange rate has a devaluation and a evaluation in a currency. However, in flexible exchange rate, it can depreciate and appreciate the value of the currency. So with this, we complete the modern action rate system available since 1973. It started off with fixed exchange rate, then we went through flexible, then we went to manage, then we saw various systems and arrangement, and lastly we saw the difference between fixed and flexible exchange 